Now in its 14th year, the Charger Biennale has attracted art lovers from right across the region to its doors with an exhibition of very diverse pieces. Rosie Lees Thompson has more on an event which has seen artists producing work under the theme of leaving the echo chamber. For the next seven weeks, Sharjah is awash with art. Paintings and sculptures are dotted across repurposed and customized sites throughout the Emirate. The showcase is Sharjah Biennial, and under the banner leaving the echo chamber, around 80 artists have tackled subjects from war and migration to climate change and politics. Visitors are taken on a multi-sensory journey, with virtual reality, performance art and sound compositions all used to arouse thoughts on societal issues. For centuries, art has been a tool for stimulating social debate. And at Sharjah's Biennial, visitors are encouraged to open their minds, reflect on preconceptions and engage in dialogue. Lebanese artist Lawrence Abu Hamdan uses audiovisual installations in his piece Once Removed to offer a new perspective on the Lebanese Civil War. The artwork centers on his muse Basil Abi Shaheen, who believes he's the reincarnated soldier Yusuf Awad, who died at the age of 16 fighting in the war. Flashbacks and unexplained memories led Abi Shaheen to extensively research the sectarian conflict to understand what he believes was his former life. He's part of my generation who don't learn anything about the war. And also he's someone who came back from as a, in his past life as a soldier from that war and who has a very personal and urgent relationship to it. He died fighting there. So he really exists in two times at once and that tension between those two times is, is what the work is really trying to, to deal with and tackle. Abu Hamdan often blurs the lines between artist and humanitarian. Through his work, he has supported human rights investigations and provided evidence at an asylum and immigration tribunal in the UK. I'm really interested in using art to experiment with the limits of what could constitute testimony to an event. It's not my job necessarily to just give the facts as you would have them in the news, but to find other strategies. Art could be its own way of making truth. Emirati artist Ala Edris analyzes the pace of progress in her hometown Sharjah over the past decade with her installation The Black Boxes of Observational Activity. By playing manipulative videos of the seemingly familiar, she challenges what the observer believes to be the truth. If you're just looking for, you know, beautiful art, to me, I think it's just decoration. You have to, you know, push boundaries with your artwork and really make the viewer question what they're seeing and what, what it means within their context. With artists looking to leave an impression, they hope their work is not just being seen, but also heard.